All right, here's an update of my intercooler build. We got this going on. Later on, what I'm going to do is because the outlet part pipe is three inch, I'm actually going to V band all this right into my intercooler, and then I'm going to V band it out of here, and then I'm going to do my my <coughs> insulated uh, pipe that goes through the wall. Um, so that I'll have complete seal plus it takes all this garbage out then I'll just heat wrap I'll just heat wrap all this intercooler piping which is will be about that size so keep following my videos now I'll upgrade I just did I'm sorry about the light I don't have much light in this corner I haven't put much up yet but I did mount this like a uh, it's a three I'm not sure, but I'll show you. It's three little fans, and this is a high-efficiency fan, and it blows either directions. You can get it to blow out or, or blow in, so that, that's a plus, and this is just something old I had, so I went ahead and used this. They do sell these, I think, at Walmart, Amazon, or wherever you get it, and I use the existing uh, bracket you get with this intercooler. This intercooler, it was about 150 bucks plus tax, which is pretty cheap it's three inch in and out and i've got the fan working and it it does you can feel the air it's being drawn through this intercooler so i uh, have it fired it up like i said tomorrow hopefully get this pipe ran through the wall now later on i'm i'm actually building me a house uh, i built me an apartment in my garage but I'm building me a house. I am actually going to put this, the intercooler, actually when I do it in the corner and I'll, I'll close the top part in, slide it in like a fireplace. Then at the top, as the, the pipe comes through, I'll have like a picture. It'll almost be like how you'd have a picture above the mantle. But this thing here will be in its own little mount. Then the fan will blow through the bottom, up through a, 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 like a little space, and then the air has to come through this. So that's what I'm going to do later on. But this is just something that I'm doing because I got my apartment. I don't have much heat in here. Um, I only paid $100 for the pellet stove. That's what this is, a pellet stove. So keep following and like and subscribe. Give me a comment, you know, how you like this stuff, whether you think it's going to work or how much, you know, efficient this will be. You know, just give me a, give me a comment or like and subscribe. Help my channel out. Because I do this stuff all the time. I just, listen, I'm just an average guy. I work a regular job, and I like to build cars, and I like to save money wherever I can. And I bought this because I've been running electric heaters. Those, it, those aren't efficient at all. Um, they don't even keep the room that warm. And I've got a concrete floor, so that's another thing. It is well insulated. It just, just concrete gets cold. So if you like them, subscribe, and do me a favor and help me build my channel up i'll do lots and lots because i'm a home improvement guy I do what i can and uh may not be the way everyone else would do it but like i said i'm going to do the actual intercooler piping right here and i'm going to v-band it right up into my intercooler to get rid of this this here so it'll actually come into a little bit better you know, I can re rearrange it any way I want to. But this is what's going to have to work for a while. I've got my motor out because I'm sealing everything up on it too because I keep feeling air coming around it somewhere. But um, like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.